The earth shook for all of us when we heard the news that our Holy Father, Pope Benedict XVI, had made the decision to step down from the chair of St. Peter. One can only imagine the intense prayer and the deep soul-searching that must have gone on for him in recent weeks and months, leading to this really very historic decision. It has been six centuries since Pope Gregory XII decided to step down from the papacy. But we should not be anxious. Some Catholics have expressed to me their anxiety. Now what? Well, what will happen now is that the Holy Spirit will guide the College of Cardinals in their election of a successor to Pope Benedict. Uh, shortly after the 28th of Feb February, uh, when the Pope officially resigns his office, the Cardinals will go to Rome and with much prayer and reflection uh, and without the influence of anything from the outside, uh, they will choose the successor of, of Benedict. And so now is the time for all of us to do two things. To pray for Pope Benedict XVI as he manages what will be, I'm sure, a challenging transition and we pray also for the church and for the new pope, whoever that may be. We're going into the Lenten season now, the best possible time for prayer. Let's be sure to include this pope and the new pope on our prayer list.